We finally have a trailer for Joker, fully ado. You know I'm gonna talk about that. Apologies for the unfamiliar setting. Am I at CinemaCon? Yes, I am. Am I there to cover CinemaCon? Absolutely not. CinemaCon's essentially a thing where studios and movie theater companies can touch base. Simplified, that's it. Which means my old movie theater crew and management, they come to CinemaCon, I come to CinemaCon to hang out with them, and that's it. Until the internet tells me that a trailer for Joker Fully Ado is gonna drop while I'm at CinemaCon. Did I buy a laptop just so I can edit this video while I was at CinemaCon to talk about this trailer? You know it. In fact, you know what? No jacket. We're just going nuts. Knocked over the microphone, sorry about that. Am I nipping? Not too bad? Great. So getting into talking about the trailer, it started out pretty amazing. The thing that surprised me most is Lady Gaga, you know, because it's been like, oh, she's Harley Quinn, obviously. She still very well could be, but she's not his therapist or psychologist. She seems to be another resident of Arkham with him. We've all heard about it. We all got to talk about it. So this movie's a musical? <laughs> Which you see the energy in the trailer, but in execution, it's largely left out. The way it seems to be executed in here is how I suppose we all figured it would be executed in here. When he had his whole daydream moment of, hey, you're the father I never had with Murray in the first movie. So I imagine it's gonna be a lot of those mental fantasies, but with music. Making it a musical strange. There's just no, no two ways about it. But I thought the energy of this trailer was solid. It didn't look like a musical. It looked like madness. A couple of Easter eggs when she puts the two fingers to her head and goes, I was like, how did you know about that? Does he just do that? Did he just walk around Arkham and be like, hey, I don't know. Kind of got me a not girlfriend last time who was definitely not my girlfriend, didn't know I existed past the elevator scene, but spoiler. It does make me question how much of this movie is in his head. I hope they do break out and cause some mayhem. Cause Joker's gotta cause mayhem and it can't just be bullshit. It seems to be legit though. In the spirit of Vegas, if I'm placing my bets, that seems to be the real world and I imagine some people died. Though I don't know how he's able to do this kind of shit without the cops just flooring him right then and there. The sets look nuts too. This movie's like a $200 million movie. It's like, well, first of all, the sets for the musicals, they look pretty extravagant. Also the licensing rights to the music, I'm sure most of the budget is that. And that's the big unknown. That's what we don't know by the end of this trailer. Is the music actually going to blend with this movie? That's essentially a layup. The sequel to the highest grossing rated R film of all time, revolving around the most popular comic book villain of all time. Might be a little biased, but I do think that that is, those are the numbers, right? The next chapter, essentially the Harley Quinn character, Looks like it's done a little differently. That's enough. Oh, by the way, musical. Weird, hope it blends, but by the end of the trailer, I don't know. That last scene in the trailer is amazing though. Where she draws a smile on the glass and says, I wanna see the real you. He just kind of frames himself up with it and then smiles. It looks like his makeup. Plus when I saw that image, I was like, well, there's the thumbnail. Thanks for that. Solid final shot of the trailer. If ever there was one. If you're gonna leave the fans with something, that's a perfect something to leave them with. In the end, I thought it was a solid first trailer, solid first look. This trailer looks like an amazing return to this world of psychosis. So thanks again for clicking on this video, even if it feels different. I was just gonna relax during CinemaCon. Found out this trailer was coming out while I was at CinemaCon. You gotta do what you gotta do. It's the Joker. Also, just letting you know, now that all the reviews for Civil War are coming out, I don't get back home until Friday, so I'll get you that review, hopefully Saturday morning. We're gonna get through this together. Wait, is that a microphone shadow on me the whole time? Damn it. Eh, whatever. So the trailer for Joker fully ado. Have you seen it? What did you think about it? Whatever you thought, comment below, let me know. And as always, if you like what you've seen here and you wanna see more, click right here to see more.